Oh, I am now at 25 subscribers. I know that ain't that high of a number, but, well, I think that's higher than I ever truly thought I'd get at the beginning of the channel. I knew maybe five at max ten people with a YouTube channel when I made this to begin with, and I figured that would be about as far as it would go. I figured about the time that I had the idea to make it was about the time the Dirty and Iron Tracing League was starting up, so I figured I'd make this more as a channel to sponsor the DRL. But then as my channel actually got a legitimate amount of views, like, I figured I'd get maybe five views a video, but now I'm getting probably on average 30 or so. I'll, I'll, many video change. Some get 15, some get my max of 350-something or more now. But nonetheless, this has gone way higher than I figured it would, so I figured I'd go back to my very first video that... I'm doing what I'm doing in this one, and that is sort of kind of special tape. And I didn't really call it special tape back then. Back then, it was just sort of thanks for the support and all that, which this is still this. But special tape is sort of just my own unique spin on this stuff because, I mean, I've actually looked it up before. And I think I've probably said this in previous videos. Somehow or another, me... <laughs> I, me... Uh, it still surprises me... I've actually created something that is first on Google. Just search special dating. Like, in any videos that have special dating in title, just search that. And I'm first. And I thank you all for making me first. That's, that's still surprising. It's not even really that complicated of a thing. It's just, if it ain't common, it's special. So I just take out common tape and put special tape in it. Somehow or another, I'm still the top person to special tape, and it's, it's still pretty got big and impressive, so, well, I figured I'd just go to, well, my first video with special tape, and then, well, look over that and sort of special tape that and critique it. I'll go ahead and say this right now. I didn't really do the accent in that video because it was more of like a thanks thing, so it was kind of cringeworthy because it, everything's better with an accent usually I it it kind of varies on the accent itself but well just watch <laughs> this and y'all can pick which y'all like better hey everyone I'm Barrett 5 and I would like still to country but not exactly an accent for the YouTube channel now that I have over 2,500 views I would have never yeah, figured now I'm about 14,000 I'm much surprised that I did I'm almost to 100 videos, and I've still got now I have like 380 or something. This has helped my team, Team Mopar, gain members over That's time. That's still true. And I've also been able to get videos on Fail Race, possibly in the maybe. future. And maybe. That's iffy. Even slap train slap train's more well. likely. I think eventually I've I will get on the there. Support, and we'll keep on doing YouTube videos for the future. That's true. I'd like to. Thank everyone all together, and specifically everyone who's been in DERL. Yeah, some more than others nowadays. My opinion a year ago is different Jeff than it is K now. Yeah, he's and iffy. Really he's helped in the past, but yeah. I know I mess with him a lot, and he deserves it. Yeah, that, that, bit that bit's still true. He needs yeah. to get on Team Mopar. Yeah, so but back then Tesla him. didn't exist, so yeah. More. Now, I don't think he's ever even going to acknowledge Team Mopar as a legitimate thing, even though Team Tesla doesn't exist at all now. Also, Cards Fan 3. Definitely Cards Fan 3. the best driver on Team Mopar. That's a truism. I'm not bad, but he's pretty good. That's a truism. will, I think he'll be better than any of us ever. Where there's a will, there's a victory, and Cards Fan 3 are going to whole heck of a heap of them. one of the best drivers on Gran Turismo. He seems to already be about the best there is with a with a controller. As far as I can He's tell, that's really still good. truism. He's won the DERL championship for season one. He probably and would have won the XFL championship if he made it in all the races. Yeah, that's a truism. And he's definitely been the best driver on Team Mopar over the years. 
I have a whole heck of a heap of good drivers helping me out. I uh, salute all y'all, and I'm not downgrading any of y'all, but Car Chain Perry is one of the original drivers, and, well, he is the best. I mean, there's a whole heck of a heap of good drivers. But, I mean, yeah, KZ, Mega Dark Lord 100, a whole heck of a heap more. He's one of the best for up-and-coming members. It's I'd say now KZ Stow 4 is considered car elite, three, where this is a year in the past. I'm okay. Really, there's no up and coming drivers now. Mega Dark Lord 100 and KZ Stow 4, I would consider both elite. Car Chain Fury is uh, like Jimmy Johnson, the here, best so current driver in existence. I'd say maybe KZ Stow 4 is Kyle Bush, and Mega Dark Lord 100 is Chase Elliott, maybe. Everyone's elite. I'm Jimmy Johnson's like sure stupidly good. Kyle Bus is really good, video, and Chase Elliott is gonna end up probably being the best driver in the future. Twenty-five views or so per video, which is nice. I'd say it's, it's about the thirty expected. now. But for those of you who are watching, whoever you are, I thank you for your support. Uh, if you yeah, haven't already, still subscribe to my channel. Definitely and a true there'll be more videos in the future, especially true. JK wrecking. Probably. Yeah, he I gets saying. mad at that, but, well, he gets mad at Team Mopar uh, beating his non-existent also, team now, too, so, yeah. Over the years, I'm sure I've made some people pretty mad, and... That's definitely a truism. I figured that out over the last year. Some people off, but... I had to make sure I said cuss word well, to make it PG-13, make it more most edgy. Most of y'all are pretty good, and I do it mainly just to en enjoy racing. That's still true. The, the, the point of racing overall is to enjoy yourself. People who say winning is the best thing, yeah, that's that true in the sense of racing is meant to be fun and winning is the most fun thing to do, but y'all should still enjoy racing even if y'all ain't winning. And enjoy it even more when Team Mopar is winning because you can join that team and then if somebody on Team Mopar wins, you win. And then you still win and enjoy yourself. Think about it, folks. Think about it. League, which is next to non-existent now. On yeah, it. that's definitely a truism. Season two. It's definitely Texas not Geo, getting a season two. Coming back because uh, ERAU fan ninety seven uh, and all that. Hopefully yeah. he can come back too and race. And he's he racing more now, and he's suffering up the the, the everything the a bit much. XFEL was nice, and then it sort of just went downhill from there. I already know you are. I, I already know I'm going to get this, most likely. I'm, I'm well aware. Yeah. But, yeah, this is still true. Yeah. All the original members to all the very newest, all y'all have helped me out quite a bit and helped the team out quite a bit, and I thank all y'all. We've gotten up to now over 70 between a lot of games. I'd say now it's around 75, awesome. 80 or so. Really GT6, I think it's up so. to 67 now. now which is pretty cotton picking impressive. Awesome. GT Sport, I hopefully can grow even sport. more. I know y'all probably by now bored listening to me rambling. That's a true. <laughs> that's a truism. I already I'm know that. Smart, and I'm not really all that fast, but I am glad yep. for y'all's support. Yeah. Now thank you all over for over the years all the support. I ain't going to Harvard. Yeah. I ain't going to Yale. I'm thank doing pretty all. good and not I to just end up in jail. I know I ain't that smart, but well, I think I put a Mo pretty good amount of heart into channel, this. So I hope y'all enjoy. League, and I'll be here to make more videos and put y'all in it. Tourism. If y'all want to be in videos, keep on racing in the DRL, and, well, y'all are being in videos, because I'll keep on putting videos from the DRL on the channel. Yeah. So I hope y'all enjoyed that. Back then, I didn't really have any of the gimmicks like the accent or the yeehaws or right yonders or stuff like that. But, well, I mean, if y'all want to, leave it in the comments below how y'all like it. More of just a general accent or more of an actual... I don't really want to say gimmicky because it's not really a fake accent. It's a sort of more of my public speaking type accent because it's louder and projects more. But, I mean, if... 
Y'all truly do like the uh, just basic original kind of robot sounding one. I can do that, but well, I know it's not necessarily worse than this, but well, I think this one's not too bad. So I hope you all have enjoyed it over the years or year and a half or year and like four months. And I thank each and every one of y'all who subscribed, and, well, there'll be more videos in the future, as I said in the very first video that I said stuff in, and, well, hopefully I get more subscribers in the future, hopefully I get more good racing in the future, and, well, most of all, I hope y'all have more fun in the future racing and watching the videos that involve y'all racing in. Yeehaw.